Hello guys, KB Old here, and welcome back to Sleeping Dogs. So, we are back, and we're in episode 10. And first things first, I'm going to access this wardrobe and change the clothes. Because I don't like these clothes. Even though I'm supposed to be a gangster, these aren't clothes that I really like. So, yep, I want to remove that. Oh, there we go. Alright, yep, that's what I want. Let's go back. Uh, yep, back. Oh, wait, no. Want something for my torso. There we go. Where? And. Yep, I think that's good. There we go. We got our normal clothes back. Alright, so, let's proceed and let's do our missions, shall we? Oop. What's going on? Right? I think there's something going on on the TV. <laughs> or the radio or whatever. Alright, let's get the door. Let's get the car. Where's our. Okay, there it is. Alright, I think I'm gonna use this one. It's been a while. Alright, so what mission are we supposed to go to now? Alright, under um under gang mission, I see. Alright, let's get there. How can we level our cop mission if we don't get any? Whatever. Excuse me, I'm just passing by. No oh! Wait, what is that? Hey! Am I supposed to well, there's a, there's a yellow arrow on top of you, so I suppose I should be stopping you. So, sorry. I'm sorry, there's a, there's a yellow arrow on top of your head, and it makes me, it makes me want to just shut down your car. I think we're getting distracted. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't think we're doing what we're, we were supposed to do, but... This is so much fun. Alright. Don't let the truck take too much damage. Right. But first, I have to... Alright. There we go. Now, let's get in the truck for whatever reason that might be. Hello. Lose the cops. You don't simply lose the cops in this game. Oh god, there's a lot of them. Okay, okay. Um, I still don't get the point of getting that. <laughs> Alright, one down. What am I doing? <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. I I, I don't remember what, what's that supposed to be for. Okay, I think I'm actually supposed to lose them because there was way too many. Okay, goodbye. Ah, good old Hong Kong. Just like the relaxing music. Just these guys are not really peaceful. Come on guys, just chill chill. It's it's fun. We're in Hong Kong. Living the awesome Chinese life into an awesome city. Hey. Yeah, I think those are for all the crimes that I've committed so far. Which includes killing a lot of people. Alright, two guys are going down. I cannot... I have no idea how I'm supposed to lose them right now. Because this doesn't go very quickly and there's a ton of cops on my tail.
Okay, maybe if I go into a tight hallway, like a place where I could run off easily and like this place for an example. Unless they catch up to me. Yep, they do. I'm not sure what I'm doing guys, I I'm just I I just want to complete this. If that isn't helping in the least. My dad will slow, slow them down, I hope. Alright, alright, we lost them! Oh, finally! Okay, drop the stolen truck to drop off. Okay, okay. Oh, there we go, that's the drop off. Here, here's your truck. I have no idea why I just did that, but here you go. Hope you enjoy it, that took a lot of trouble to take. Job complete! 10,000 freaking bucks, oh my god, alright, oh well, I, <laughs> I have no trouble with that, alright. Alright, we got quite a lot of money. Let's go see if we can buy a car. Hey, can I buy a car? I guess you're not the guy that I'm supposed to see for that. Well, this. Oh, there we go. Right. Hey, wait! Check out what I got. Let's see. I, I have like 125,000. Okay. And that is enough to buy a car. But I need more face. How do I get face? Hmm. Well, this one looks. I don't know, it has some kind of style to it. Um. Though this one looks pretty cool. But I need face. How do you get face? Hmm. Well, whatever. I'm just going to figure out how to get face and then I'm going to buy them. I'm just gonna keep my money for now. Yeah, but apparently I haven't clean enough, so. Because you need to have a better face to get a better car, which doesn't make any sense, but whatever. <laughs> Okay, so, let's see. Oh, there's a taxi right there. Maybe it can bring me to, to the gang mission. Hey, can you bring me to the Winston gang? Well, I wanted to hire you, but it seems like my instinct took, o took over. Okay, well, whatever. Just... Oh, God! God, we're getting distracted over and over again. Hey, I just wanted to hire you, I'm sorry, my instinct took over. Alright then, let's fight, whatever. Right, goodbye, now I'm taking your taxi. No, taxis these days, they just want they just want you to drive instead of them. They're lazy. Oh boy. Let's get, let's get to the gang mission after like 10 minutes of rambling. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that was way too entertaining. And that was worthwhile too. We got 10,000 bucks. Okay. Uh, getting there. Oh, no, I'm not getting that van. Took way too much trouble the first time. Just look at the map. Um, nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, there we go, alright, I can... Oh, there we go, I should have known earlier that I could uh, get my missions that way. With the M key. Alright, that's cool. I was wondering if you could do that, oh god, I'm not driving on the right way. The right side of the street. Nice music going on. Uh oh, I'm not sure if I'm actually in a gangster place right now, I think I am. Yep, I am actually in a gangster place. Alright, that's cool. Let's get out here. Oh, that's... that's good music. It's just... Just calm, child music. It's cool. Let's fly for a little bit. 
think it's the first time that I had so much fun outside the missions. Oh! I think I should do that someday in, in this game. Just drive around and have fun. Not do any missions. No, Gangs to Life is... It's exhausting. <laughs> you just get missions after missions. You don't get any sleep. You just go do missions. That's all you do. And that taxi is gonna get quite a lot of damage. are quite big buildings. I think I've never been never, I've never been here. Uh, not sure though. Right, pick up your tuxedo. Oh I see, we're going to the wedding. Alright, let's be wedding gangsters again. See you again soon. Bye bye. <laughs> God, that's pretty strange. Hey, um, I mean, for a gangster. I'll get there as soon as possible. Don't worry, there's still time. Don't start without me. We're really going to the wedding, are we? Wow. We're like in the huge. We're like the the downtown area. That's cool. In the huge buildings, I like that. Oh well, I guess that's one way to do it. Okay, move around or else I'm gonna run all of you guys over. Alright, you had a warning. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just I just feel I just feel like that, like a guy in Tuxedo going to a wedding that is actually a gangster. You know, just have to have some fun. Just being a guy that is a gangster and oh, whatever. Right, here we are. I'm so happy you can make it. Congratulations. Peggy, you look stunning. <laughs> Thanks, Wei. <laughs> you both must be very happy. Yes. The best day of your life. So they say. You know what? They're right. <laughs> <laughs> if you say so. Oh, Uncle Paul. Welcome. My guest of honor. I'm happy to be here. It's nice to see someone who wants to be a good family man. Not enough of that nowadays. Hi. You look absolutely lovely, my dear. <laughs> Thank you. Almost as lovely as your mother and <laughs> Oh, and this is true. I expect the food to be. Wait, wait. Fantastic. I got a case of the chairman's favorite wine in my car. I forgot to bring it in. Do you mind grabbing in and making sure they know it's for him? I'm gonna make sure he gets inside, okay? Yeah, sure thing, Winston. You gotta enjoy your day, okay? Where do you park? Ah, right through there. I'm going, I'm going. Just bring it into the kitchen. Shit! Oh, the one didn't broke. Didn't break. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Wait, what? Did something happen in there? Holy hell! What? Are they attacking us during the wedding? What the hell? Um... Find a way inside the event can- Oh, alright, alright. I'll try. I guess. Right, I guess that's a good way. Or maybe not. Right, let me try to Okay, there we go. That might be good. Yep. Find out what's going on outside. Well, probably something very terrible. Okay, let's go. Holy hell. Damn! Oh, that's a ruined wedding. Eh, wedding. Wedding. Are these dog eyes guys? Because seriously, they are low if they are doing that. Face the gangster in tuxedo!
and you go goodbye. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Oh god, okay. We need to defeat this guy as quick as possible. Because he has a weapon. We need that. Damn it. Hey, I want just one too. Uh oh, I'm going to die. Alright, let's go look for Winston. Oh god, there's blood. That's not good. Hide. And that's not the best of winning, is it? Okay. I seriously thought they wouldn't do that. But of course, if there are dog eyes guys, what if what would you expect from them? Okay, let's get some ammo. Before we continue, hey, I just want to. Okay, never mind. Looks like I have max ammo. Oh god! Winston! Holy freaking hell! Oh god, Peggy! Wait. Wow! Good Peggy. That's terrible! She, she doesn't deserve this. Winston! Winston! I didn't expect stuff to go that badly, actually. If there was something to go that would come as bad, you know? I, maybe if I would have expected something bad to happen, but not that bad. Holy freaking... Damn. It's got to be the worst wedding ever. Okay, that's a machine gun. I want that. Right. Oh, I hear some guys. I'm going to hide. You guys better come out, because you've seriously ruined my the wedding of the leader. You guys deserve to pay for that. Seriously do. Call the rest of the boys! I need them here now! God. Oh! Wow, they're everywhere! Holy hell! Okay, hide! Please! Please wait. Don't be an idiot now. Hide! I said hide! Come on! Whatever, I'm just going to fire just like that. Yeah, I can't I can't hide. Oh there we go, now I can. Go to the stairs. I'm just going to take care of a few of these guys first. Alright, let's get there. Quickly. Clear out the catering staff out of the main hall. Alright. Goodbye. Is there any more? Doesn't seem. Seems like so. Alright. Let's hide. Did I switch firing mode? I think I did. Oh, there we go. Go for Uncompo. Okay, let's go quickly. Damn. <laughs> I still 
Wow, I'm still amazed at the proportion of the stuff that's going on. Well, are you alright? Alright, no, that's not Uncle Paul. Never mind. <laughs> okay. Uncle Paul! Are you okay? Can you walk? What's going on? What happened to Winston? Okay, come on. We're gonna get you out of here. Uncle Paul! You're hurt! It's nothing but a little scratch. You look sort of... We gotta get you to a hospital. Okay. Let's go quickly. Before he actually dies. Uh oh. Of course we should have expected these guys. Oh no, I just killed that girl! Alright. Sorry, but we're in a hurry here. Okay. Kind of no, no hurry. Oh no, we can't jump. Of course we can't. This must pay. Right, quick. Quickly now. We got okay we we, we got that, that guy right there. Yeah, if they get Uncle Po Uncle Po as well, that's not gonna be good. Right. Come on, quicker. Are they? Right. right there. Come on, come on. Oh God, it's getting fired at. Oh, it's right there. Damn it. Hurry, hurry. Bring him. No, 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 no. Right. Useful contact stuff. Right. Run, 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 run. Come on. I suppose these guys are. Yep, there are our allies. Right, we did it. Friends, the police show up. <laughs> Are you gonna take care of my uncle? And if anything happens to him, I'm holding Hello, you police? personally responsible. Oh, thank God. Are we clear? Okay, okay. Okay, well, that wasn't the happy wedding that we all expected. <laughs> At least we got a winning suit, I guess. Meet at the rendezvous point. Where have you been? Stuck in traffic. It's Hong Kong. Fuck me. You think showing up for these things is easy for me? I know you've been through a lot, boy. More than we have any right to ask. Now the wedding. It was a massacre, Raymond. A massacre. Winston was a red pole, sure, but his wife, a fucking gunned down his wife on her wedding day. We knew you would become personally attached, Wayne. It's inevitable in an operation like this. And seeing something like that would be hard. Hard for anyone. It's war now. No, it's not. You're a cop, all right? Your job is to enforce the law. You can't remember that? I'll pull you out right now. Pull me out? Your job was to get close to Winston. Now, that's not much of a strategy anymore. Get close to... Open your eyes, Raymond. I am Winston now. With him gone, I'll be taking his place. You want the chairman? I report oh to him. Oh, God. You want the Red Poles? I'm one of them. That's what worries me, Way. You're one of them. You want to give up the best undercover HKPD has ever had? Your best shot taking down the sun on Yi? Exactly. We done? Yeah, we're done. So that means Winston actually died? You look after that people, okay? Get Peggy out of here. Winston! She doesn't No!
Right, okay, so it seems like that stuff has taken quite a turn here, so it seems like Winston is actually gone, and so now we are leading this this part of the Twilights, and this, this story is starting to be quite interesting, because now our character has to decide, will he actually stay with the gang, because he has attachment to them, or will he respect his duties as a law enforcement person, as a police officer. So yeah, we shall see. So anyways guys, thank you all for watching this episode of Sleeping Dogs, which was quite quite a surprise, I did not expect that anyways. So yeah, so thank you all for watching, and I shall see you all next time.